which one of you who started the rumor that my nose is fake? Because what y'all trying to do is take my who's daddy and you Grinches can never. First of all, I feel like this was directed at me. And if you have a problem with me, I would appreciate it if you addressed me directly instead of coming to the internet causing a scene. And I did not start the rumor about your nose, but I definitely helped spread it because we've all seen the pictures. We remember what you looked like just a couple of years ago. Okay. And as far as your who's daddy, been there, done that. Okay. We are past that. Nobody wants that man but you. Who we should. Oh, one thing about a hit who? She gonna holler. And that's exactly what you're doing. You want to be relevant so bad that you you jumping into a conversation that ain't even about you. But let me tell you something, sweetie. You over here directing all that energy at me. You need to be directing that energy at that little grinchy order you got going on down there. Huh? You want me to air out all your business? You want me to let them know that you being my, being my daddy's DM, trying to get them to let you back in Whoville? I ain't going to talk about the last who nigga you was with said you gave them who herpes. Okay, but I'm going to keep that right there. I'm going to leave this right here, right where it's at, right, right, right in the gutter. And just to clear up all the rumors that you helped spread, no, no, I ain't getting no surgery, Hilda. This is, this is my, this is my natural nose. You see that? Natural, natural, hmm. Hello, Huisha, this is, this is kind of sad. I don't like to make it a point to travel below the poverty line, but if you insist, I'll come say hi. The nose job chopped. Okay, we can all see it. Just let it go. It's 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 embarrassing at this point. A Grinchy odor, the Grinch is a munch, I would know. Okay? And I haven't I haven't slid into anything in a very long time. That's for broke people. I'm so sorry. I don't, I don't know who we should, maybe with some proper guidance and just a little bit of help, right? You may be able to um, get away from this, this, this whore, but you know, I'm always here to lend a helping hand, okay? All right. Below the poverty line. Stay simple. You think just because you up there on Mount Crimpy beneath you, I'm the one sneak this in? Hand me that who, Max. See, my man give me results. Your man give you who hash. Go on, hootie booty. Go on, get in the camera. Yeah, Grinch, because this is for Hilda, who clearly didn't learn her lesson the first time. Tell him what the who I said. I can't who with you. Louder. I can't who with you. <laughs> yeah, 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 I, I, I told you she'd be beating on that man. It's not mm. funny. I'm sorry. He crying out for help at this yeah, point. He really is. He really is. And you know what? I try so hard to mind my rich business and stay do, out of the you? business of the people in the trenches because you know I. Yeah, I know yeah, you don't yeah, like. You know how I don't like poor people. people. But it's so hard because she be running around Whoville complaining mm -hmm. about the Grinch whole time she in the house mm -hmm. beating up mm -hmm. on her damn husband. Poor and Whoville. you know, you know they got kids. Mm. And the kids, the little whoettes. Oh my God, I feel so bad for them. It's such a toxic household. She's such an evil well, little woman. Look at the pot. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you're not helping. Yeah, but, I, you know, I, I, I just hope she get her life together. And soon, because the way that she's going. Mm. I leave that boy wet. Now I ain't talking about the sweat. He was gripping on my back. Why he eating on his cat? I bet that nigga love me when that pussy squirt back, 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 back. Are you expecting anybody to believe that I we not only have to text the who first, but multiple times, back to back. Please, the antics are getting a bit outlandish. But you know what's not so outlandish? You know what makes a lot of sense? The fact that Trish, Trish who, you know, your neighbor, her son looks a lot like your son. And your son looks a lot like his daddy. Now, um, I'm no mathematician, but one plus one going to always equal two. Wait, well. In this case, his one plus her one has equaled a little third. Hmm. I think you have bigger fish to fry, Huisha, instead of coming to the internet and continuously causing a scene. Do better. Okay, Hilda, it wasn't you. It wasn't you down at the Huma trying to get Zaddy to taste your roasted potato sacks. But what very much is true is the fact that you reaching as high as the mill was when he was tiptoeing around Martha May. I don't even need to explain anything to you, Hilda. Let me break it down for you. Trish, who is my cousin? And her who baby daddy is my who baby daddy's cousin. So, 
And before this go any further, let me just go ahead and calm these little rumors down. It wasn't a who surgery, it was a who procedure. I am that who. Nah. Girl, all I heard was that's my sister, baby, daddy, cousin from up the street. And it's ghetto, which coming from you is very fitting. And you're in denial. Y'all ask who sisters. Y'all are sharing that man. The only one in denial about that is you. And if you want to talk about your surgery or procedure or whatever it is that you want to call it, let's talk about why you needed it. Because this same time, just a couple of years ago, you was running your mouth and Rochelle who had to run in your shit. Yeah, we all saw that too. You know, if you're going to start lying so much, you might want to stop being so public because those tables, they always going to turn, okay? I don't want to have to keep airing your business out, but you might want to watch it. Here we go. Here we go. I know Rochelle. Oh, humpback, hot foot, long neck, short toe, who got a who rot. And you keep hollering about the ghetto like you ain't got a white fridge and furl on the windows. So I have decided to be the bigger person and squash this menial beef between Huisha and I. Um, it's been long enough. So I asked her to come and meet me um, at one of my favorite restaurants. I know that she's not used to being on this side of Whoville. Um, you know, but hopefully she knows how to keep it cute because this is a classy establishment. And hopefully we can talk out our differences and, and just move forward. I don't anticipate us becoming friends because of the whole class thing but um you know i'm tired of the back and forth so let's let's see if we can if we can make it work guess who i got a call from asking if she can meet me and rochelle for brunch baby you never believe it that who better not start no mess if she know what's good for her So, um, I see you guys have squashed your little beef since you had to beat her ass at that Christmas party. I'm, I'm glad to see that y'all are, um, doing better. Um, Huisha, were you able to look at the menu before we got here? I know this is a, this isn't quite where you're used to. I don't know if you had a chance to look at it before. Oh, um, Rochelle, I know you had, um, what earlier this week. Were you able to get the custody back of your kids or... Well, how did that, is that, is that inappropriate? We had to drop Rochelle off a little early. So who we should ask me if I wanted to go shopping with her. Um, and yeah, okay, sure. I love to shop, but I wasn't expecting this, although I should have been. All right. Um, this was okay. Bye. <laughs>